fireball meteors are possible over the U.S. tonight as South Torrid Meteor Shower Peaks. The South Torrid and North Torrid Meteor Showers peak in early November. Here's everything you need to know about this month's double header of shooting stars. Two meter showers with long broad peaks will bring shooting stars to night skies worldwide this month starting tonight. First come the South Torrids which run from September 23rd to November 12th and peak overnight on November 4th to 5th as tonight. And then come the North Torrids which are active from October 13th to December 2nd and peak overnight November 11th to 12th. Although those are the peaks both showers are long-lasting. That means they have broad peaks during which about five shooting stars per hour can be expected. The two showers also merge, increasing your odds of seeing the wayward meteor this week. The South and North Torrids may not be prolific in terms of the number of shooting stars, but what they do offer is fireballs. These exceptionally bright meteors can be seen over the very wide area according to the Center for Near-Earth Object Studies. Given their timing, these shooting stars are sometimes called Halloween fireballs. Both meteor showers result from debris left in the inner solar system by comet 2P NK, which orbits the Sun every three uh, and a quarter years, the shortest orbital period of any known comet in the solar system, according to NASA. It was last year in October 2023 and is due back in early 2027, but sky watchers can expect to see a showing of shooting stars from the comet's debris regardless of the year. This year, the south torrids are more likely to impress. The peak occurs while the moon is in its waxing crescent phase, meaning Earth's natural satellite will create a little pollution, a little light pollution, and dip below the horizon soon after sunset. That's not the case for the North Torrids, which peak under a waxing gibbous moon just a few nights before its full phase. The strong moonlight in the night sky will make it tougher to see faint meteors, but it won't obscure the spectacular fireballs that are possible during both showers. Although the South and Northern Torrids are visible throughout the sky, they appear to originate from the constellation Taurus, which rises in the east late at night during November. You do not need a pair of stargazing binoculars or a telescope to enjoy meteor showers. Your naked eyes, if given some time to adjust to the darkness of the night, will do just fine. This is by Jamie Carter on Life Science. Please leave your comments and thank you for your support. support my Patreon account. The daily posts are five videos daily and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box below.